So in the early 1980s, we were struggling to find ways to use the immune system to treat cancer that had not ever been done for patients with the common solid cancers, and we were working with a growth factor called interleukin-2. And in those early efforts, we treated 66 patients in a row with varying doses and schedules of IL-2 with and without cells that we might create using IL-2 in patients and saw no responses in any of those first 66 patients until we saw this young woman in 1984 who had widespread melanoma, had been through conventional treatments, nothing had worked. We gave her a new schedule of interleukin-2 that was quite aggressive and quite amazingly all of her cancer disappeared. And that showed us for the first time that it would be possible to use an immunotherapy, a stimulation of the body's immune system as a sole treatment to cause cancer to disappear, that it was possible.